satellites collect a vast amount of data from space. But space missions take a long time and a lot of money to get off the ground. And once the collected data reaches the scientists behind those missions, it can happen that the data is still not easily exploitable or usable by other researchers who miss out on this potential know-how of accumulated knowledge. Often collected in raw status, the data needs to be processed, indexed and archived in order to become valuable and meaningful information to the scientific community at large. So definitely uh, an infrastructure is needed in Europe to support the accumulation of space data and uh, its exploitation in the long term. Uh, in the long term means uh, after 10, 20 years as a minimum. Uh, and this is what we are um, now uh, establishing with the Ulisse project. Um, uh, we demonstrated that uh, such an infrastructure is feasible uh, from the technical point of view and uh, also is very beneficial for the community. Europe has the, the ability, has the power, this intellectual power to uh, be very autonomous in this field and I think it's very important for us to be autonomous in this field because we have the potentiality to do this. ULYS is one of the space projects funded by the European Commission under the seventh framework program for research. The EU is fully committed to supporting a wide range of research programs in order to ensure the exhaustive exploitation of valuable space data, which will not only allow for better understanding of our own planet, but aim at contributing to higher protection of our society against potential threats from space in the long term.